first time I came to Detroit was 1958, and, uh, and that was with Ray Charles. And uh, at that time, Detroit was flourishing, and it was a great, great place to be. Um, uh, I didn't live here at the time, but there was so much activity going on here that uh, this was one of the favorite places in the country. There were three places I really wanted to even to, to, to land, and uh, the two of them happened to be stuck with, with a D. Uh, the big D was uh, Dallas, and uh, the other bigger D was Detroit. So Detroit went out, and there was a good jazz thing happening. Always a jazz thing happening. On Sunday, on Sundays, there was a place called Mr. Kelly's that uh, people could bring their children out on Sunday afternoon and hear some live jazz. You might run into West Montgomery. You might not run into Sonny Rollins, you might run into use of 
music while you have breakfast at the place at 10 and then um, say four or five o'clock or six o'clock that would close and people go right to church from there. So, so it, you know, it's a very, jazz music is a very important part of our culture, of our lives, and it's a, I mean, like I said, people try to separate it, but it's all for one.